guys. What's up? We're back. Oh my god, this ground is so freaking dirty. And it's kind of bad out. I hope you guys like these shades. Um, but yeah, welcome to another Q&A with a shot. Because yeah, sorry about the wind. Um, it's wind, so hopefully you guys can't really pick it up. But yeah, we're currently at my high school football field and stadium and track. Um, because I was training and I was like, oh wow, I need to get a video out for YouTube. Well, before I came here, I knew I had to get a video out for YouTube. And I was like, ah, I don't know what to do. And I got bored after finishing my English paper. And I came and started training here. So, um, I was like, wow, I should really just sit down and film a Q&A. So, that's what we're here doing. And I asked Instagram some questions. Asked Instagram to ask me some questions and you guys put up. So, let's get into it. So I haven't posted in a while. I think the last video I posted was two weeks ago. I don't know. But yeah, let's answer some questions. So, um, first question. Why am I going to college so far away? Um, so, I have not applied to college. That means I have not gotten accepted into college. But some of my friends know I'm, I think I'm applying to five California schools. If you don't know, I live on the East Coast. So California is a good 2,000 miles away. It's very bizarre for people from this area to even go that far. To even like move coast is crazy. But if I get in, I think I'm gonna go. I'm applying to Actually, a college video should be out in April or May, so I won't reveal which five schools I'm applying to, but I will say I am applying to some, and it should be really cool. It should be really fun, and hopefully we get in. So yeah, um, the reason I'm applying there is because I want to like, I want to start my own adventure over there, and um, what I'm majoring in, that's kind of like the hub. California's the hub. And so I definitely want to get a good internship or, you know, get into the industry, things like that, things of that nature. And I'll explain more in that video. So yeah. Another question is why do I play lacrosse or like what inspired me to things like that, things of that nature. Um, Lacrosse, like, I saw it in a movie, and I was like, wow, I want to be that guy so bad, and I realized I don't want to be that guy, and then I was like, oh my gosh, but lacrosse seems like so much fun, seems like a sport. My dad played football, so I was never really a football guy, because, like, why would I want to also play football? But then I saw lacrosse, and I was like, wow, this is going to be my sport. At the time, I had already started running track, so I was already running track, but then I started doing swim, and then when it got announced that lacrosse was coming to my school, so like, I was like, I was part of the first year that like it was introduced, like the first year lacrosse came to my like school district, I was playing, so freshman year, I started playing lacrosse, and I, I love the sport. It's so much fun. Um, I get bruised up a lot, but I absolutely love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. I do wish the team was better, like, emotionally and mentally. I wish it was better. Like, I don't care if we win the games. I don't care if we lose the games. Yeah, it's amazing, but, like, the team won't, like, it won't be fun if I'm not mentally in the right space because of the team, you know what I'm saying? So I definitely wish that was better, but I absolutely love playing the sport. It's so much fun. I fell in love with it. So yeah, I started playing because I saw it 
on a TV show and then I actually played it and then I loved it. And if you wanna know my position, I am a midfield short stick. Um, and I'll insert pictures somewhere over here. But yeah, um, another question I got is, am I single? So in my Valentine's video, I was not single. I had someone and then we broke up and today is March 16th. Um, we broke up this week actually. I'm not sad about it. I think it was for the best. So yeah, so there's nothing really to heal from. I'm not sad in any way, shape or form. I, I think it's better this way. Like summer is about to start and like I'm about to be doing so many things and yeah, it's gonna be so much fun. Speaking of summer, another question I got is, what are my plans this summer? Um, this is my last high school summer. So like after this summer, I will never be like, there'll never be like a normal summer ever again because I'll be a senior, oh my God. So I'm really excited about that. But this summer I know, okay, this doesn't count because like I'm still gonna be in school, but June 1st and 2nd, I'm going to a festival with my friend. Um, so yeah, that's like, we're starting off with a bang. It's a two day festival. So I'm really excited, me and her, but to have so much fun. Um, and I get to like, I just get to take a bunch of photos, get to listen to music. And I just, I, I just get to have fun. Like get to be at the beach cause the festival is on the beach. Like it's on sand. So that's gonna be so much fun. Another, um, another thing I'm doing is I'm going to a summer camp, so that's fun. And then um, I'm either going to New Mexico or I'm going to Malibu. That will be in another vlog because I get my, okay, Malibu is a summer program, so yeah, if I get in, I get to go to Malibu. On the other hand, New Mexico is a mission trip that I just get to go on if I want to. So yeah, but I find out April 14th if I'm going to Malibu, California, and it's actually for a college I'm applying to. So yeah, I'll talk a little bit more about that. Um, I'm really excited for that also. And then I'm just, I'm just doing so many fun things. What are my birthday plans is another question. Um, right now, nothing much, nothing too crazy. I'm turning 16, so it's definitely gonna be bizarre. Um, I'm not having a huge party. I'm going out and getting brunch with a couple of friends and it's gonna be super chill, super chill, super, Nothing like, nothing too crazy. If you don't know, my birthday is May 11th. And yeah, yeah. Um, and then I'm probably gonna have dinner with a bunch of family and family friends. So like, there's like a party for me and my school friends. And then there's a party with the adult people I know. And yeah. So, um, how am I feeling about being a senior next year? Um. It's definitely gonna be crazy. I'm gonna be a younger senior because I'm graduating early. But I'm really excited. I'm really excited because this is what I want. I don't think I like, I would be normal or like I would feel good if I had to stay another year. Um, if I had to stay another year, I would be applying to this program for dance. Um, just because that program, it's another school and it would start at like 12 p.m. and end at 4 p.m. and I wouldn't be able to do anything after school. But I'm not staying another year. So I'm actually like really just excited because high school holds so many boundaries. Okay, wait, this leads into another question. Why am I graduating early? So I'm just gonna answer both, but um, High school is holding me back from all the things I want to do in my life. But at the same time, like, I feel like 
high school is not like people in high school really make me mad and it's not like because they're mean or rude or anything it's because a lot of them can't live up to reality i'm so like wow focus on the future focus on what life actually has for me and other people are just like oh hey let's live in the present and let's get bad grades it's like it doesn't upset me but it's like i don't have time for that like I'd rather be focusing on, hey, how am I going to pay my bills? I'd rather be focusing on, hey, how am I going to pay for my next meal? Not focusing on, hey, when, in the, when is this like show about to come out? Oh, hey. But, like, I will have those moments and I will have those times where I hang out with the people I want to hang out with and I will have those times for dilly dally, whatever, and like party teenager stuff. But at the end of the day, it's like, I actually have things to go out and focus on. So, a lot of teenagers aren't worried about how they're going to get to college. Oh, what college am I going to apply to? A lot of high schoolers aren't focused on that. So, when they're not focused on it, it's like, who am I actually going to talk to about it? Like... I get to talk to the people who actually want to focus on those things and, like, aspire to do those things. So, I'm excited. I'm excited about it. Um, senior year is going to be so much fun. I can't wait to vlog it. Oh, my gosh. There's, like, there's so many exciting events coming up. There's so many things and doing, like, senior activities, like painting pants or whatever. So, I'm really excited to do those things with you guys. So yeah, um, I think I'm going to answer one more question. Sorry, there's like a weird car driving by. They're just like zooming or whatever. And there's also geese heading my way. So we got to hurry this up. Okay, what the heck? Ah, I don't do geese. What the frick? Okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Inspired to do when I grow up. That's my next question. Oh my gosh. Okay. So what I aspire to do when I grow up is actually kind of complex and it's not like really a normal thing for people to do. Um I aspire to be in media. Um, there's a couple forms I want to be in media with. And one of the, like, I want to be in media, like, not just social media content, but, like, media in general. Oh, my gosh, these keys are heading my way. Media content, like, fashion. I want to be able to show up to fashion shows and, like, get to work with fashion designers and walk red carpets. Like, the glitz and glam of it, like, that's so fun to me. And it's not fun to a lot of people, but it's fun to me. Okay, we actually have to move because these geese are like heading my way and I have a fear of geese. So, yeah, you're probably like, Jason, you're crazy. Just a little bit because I don't do geese. But, oh my god. We will be releasing that. But thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe, comment, and turn on those notifications. And if you want the answer, I guess you're just going to have to wait. But I love you guys so freaking much. You guys are freaking amazing. Yeah. So, you know, hit the world. Be great. Do what you love to do because who is freaking stopping you, okay? Who is stopping you? Yourself. You're the only person standing in your way, okay? So I love you guys. Peace out. Stay safe out there. Ma. can bike up the bleachers. Was that like a bad idea? I think I'm gonna find it. Bike up Uh, but it's like it's meant for wheelchairs, so I feel like if they can do it, I can do it. With a with my mug on me. Oh, DD, oh, what did it? We're testing audio right now to make sure everything's just.